the Fort Lauderdale Beach in Florida, where it is currently 87 degrees. Just look how beautiful that is. I kind of wish I was down there right now swimming in the ocean. <laughs> well, let's send you right over to Weather Authority meteorologist Josh Keselowski. Josh, I'm a little jealous right now. I kind of want to go down to Florida, but you know what? Can we expect some of the same type of temperatures as we get closer into tomorrow? Yeah, Laura, I would say tomorrow is going to be an improved weather day versus what we had today. And actually tomorrow looks like the weather we just had on Friday and Thursday. And a quick story, I've been to Fort Lauderdale before, but just the airport. I've never actually been to the beach there. Uh, I'm with you. I'd love to check it out. And back to here this evening, I still have the rain jacket on hand nearby in case I get a little rain shower outside the deck. It's currently not raining here, so I think I'll be okay. Let's get over to the forecast here for the rest of the weekend. Do you have plans, not just me, maybe on the holiday, but maybe tomorrow? And you're looking forward to some nicer weather, kind of like what happened, you know, yesterday and Thursday. Here's the breakdown for the remaining of the weekend. This evening and overnight, temperatures will be cooling down into the upper 50s to around 60. So not as cool as chill chilly as it was last night and this morning. Many areas this morning were in the 40s, Syracuse bottom at 51. So there will be some more rain, a little thunder this evening, and then overnight we'll clear out, and I think we'll get some areas of thick fog setting up, maybe in your neighborhood. Sunday, again, remember the weather we had yesterday and the weather we had on Thursday. It's coming back. Nice, sunny, dry, maybe some morning clouds, fog. High temperature there, 82, and without the threat for any rain. On Monday, still a little iffy with the weather forecast here. There could be a little rain in the morning, then it might stop and we might get some breaks of sun out. Late morning, lunchtime, midday, the more sun we see, the stronger any storm could develop into the afternoon hours. Highs there only in the mid and upper 70s, breezy and humid. So we'll still have to look at the Monday forecast here, even into tomorrow. All right, tonight as you're scrolling on your phone through socials and other apps and Hopefully looking at our CNY Central Mobile News app there, I've got a forecast here for you, a story on the app. It talks about beach weather, boating weather, pool weather, and more. It's also on our website tonight, cnycentral.com. Includes the cut the grass or pass forecast and keeping cool by the pool forecast as well. Here you go, live triple Doppler, sponsored by Falls So Service Experts. We're right about here, just on the top part of the E in the word Syracuse here on the map. So we're kind of not in the rain at the moment. Heavy rain has come through. Some thunder has come through earlier this afternoon. Around 3 o'clock, we were saying between 3 and 9 p.m. is when the rain would begin and kind of move through. We still have some rain just west of Syracuse. I want to zoom into western Onondaga County. If you're in Syracuse like us here at the new station in downtown area, yeah, there's going to be some more downpours leaving Camillus and Fairmount, heading due east, also through Onondaga Hill, heading over towards the Nedro area in the next 15, 20 minutes. Down the south, Tompkins and Cortland counties also still dealing with some rain here. Groton, Ithaca over to Dryden and further off the east, east of Cortland. Temperatures right now. 65 degrees as we're hovering around 80 earlier this afternoon. We will be getting down, I think, with the dew points or temperatures near the dew point tonight. So lows again within a few degrees of 60. Lots of nice weather out west earlier today, and that's going to be our fate for tomorrow. Nice when you don't have even have the chance of rain in the forecast like yesterday and Thursday. 59 my forecast low tonight. The evening rain or thunder ends partly cloudy. Some dense fog overnight could be locally thick maybe where you live. High tomorrow 82 looks nice on Memorial Day. Maybe a little bit of rain in the morning. Then the sun comes out. Then some storms in the afternoon 79. A hit or miss type deal Tuesday, Wednesday, but getting cooler midweek. Nicer though Thursday, Friday and Saturday without the threat for rain 65, 73 and 79 degrees. Allura. I'm all